Picture this. A man who could memorize entire books, visualize intricate inventions in his mind and who spoke eight languages. This isn't a superhero from a comic book, but a real person named Nikola Tesla. Tesla wasn't just a genius, he was an extraordinary one. His mind was a veritable treasure trove of information, capable of storing and recalling entire books, a feat that many of us can only dream of. And his mental prowess didn't stop there. He could visualize complex inventions down to the finest details without needing to sketch them out. In addition to these remarkable abilities, Tesla was a polyglot, fluent in eight languages. His lingual arsenal included his native Serbian, as well as Czech, English, French, German, Hungarian, Italian, and even Latin. So, who was this remarkable man? Let's dive into the life of Nikola Tesla. Born on July 10, 1856, in Smiljan, Croatia, Nikola Tesla was destined for greatness from a young age. Raised in an intriguing mix of cultures, Tesla's early years were shaped by his Serbian heritage and the Austrian Empire's influence. He was the fourth of five children, born to an Orthodox priest father and a mother renowned for her inventive mind. From the outset, Tesla showed signs of his genius. An avid reader with an insatiable curiosity, he had a photographic memory that allowed him to store images and detailed information in his mind. Fascinated by the natural world and the mysteries of the universe, Tesla was particularly drawn to the study of electricity. At the age of 14 Tesla moved to Karlovac to attend high school where he excelled in physics and mathematics. His teachers were astounded by his ability to perform complex calculations in his head. It was during these formative years that Tesla decided to pursue electrical engineering, inspired by demonstrations of electricity by his physics professor. Upon graduation, Tesla faced a series of personal challenges, including a bout of cholera and the death of his father. Undeterred, Tesla enrolled at the Austrian Polytechnic in Graz, Austria, in 1875. Here he studied electrical engineering, often outperforming his peers and even his professors. In the early 1880s, Tesla moved to Budapest, Hungary, where he began working at the Central Telephone Exchange. His ingenuity and knowledge of electrical systems were instrumental in the company's advancements, and Tesla quickly made a name for himself. But Tesla's ambitions were bigger than Budapest. His sights were set on the land of opportunity, America. Little did he know his journey had just begun, and his future contributions would change the world as we know it. In 1884, with just a few cents in his pocket, Tesla arrived in New York City. The bustling metropolis was a far cry from his humble beginnings in the rural landscapes of Europe. But Tesla was not deterred. He was ready to make his mark on the world. Like a moth drawn to the flame, Tesla was inevitably attracted to the world of electrical engineering. He soon found himself working for none other than the renowned inventor, Thomas Edison. This was a match seemingly made in heaven, a union of two great minds, however it was not to last. Their partnership soured over a fundamental disagreement about electric power. Edison was a staunch proponent of direct current or DC, a system that, while effective, had limitations in terms of distance and power. Tesla, on the other hand, believed in the potential of alternating current or AC, which could deliver electricity over long distances with less loss of energy. The tension between the two inventors reached a breaking point, leading to Tesla's departure from Edison's company. However, this was not the end for Tesla, but rather a new beginning. He was soon approached by another giant in the field of electricity, George Westinghouse. Westinghouse saw the potential in Tesla's AC system and offered him a partnership. Together they would challenge Edison's monopoly on electric power. Tesla's AC system was revolutionary. It allowed for the efficient transmission of electricity over long distances, opening up new possibilities for industry and society. It was the key to unlocking the full potential of electric power and laid the groundwork for the modern electrical grid. Despite the initial resistance to AC power, Tesla and Westinghouse's vision eventually won out. The success of the AC system marked a major turning point in the history of electricity, and its impact can still be felt today every time we flip a switch or plug in an appliance. Tesla's AC system would change the world, but that was just the beginning of his groundbreaking work. As the 20th century dawned, Tesla was busy making science fiction a reality. Nikola Tesla, the mastermind behind some of the world's most monumental inventions, was shaping the future with his brilliant mind and his creative genius. One of his most famous inventions, the Tesla coil, was a transformer circuit that produced high voltage, low current, high frequency alternating current electricity. This creation was not just a scientific marvel, 
It was a spectacle of light and sound that captivated audiences and symbolized the power and potential of electricity. Tesla didn't stop there. He was fascinated by the idea of transmitting power without wires. He envisioned a world where electricity was as freely available as the air we breathe. This dream led him to his next big project, the wireless transmission of electricity. Tesla's experiments in this field were groundbreaking. He conducted numerous demonstrations where he lit up light bulbs from across the room without any physical connection. Then there was his most ambitious and controversial project, the Wardenclyffe Tower. This was intended to be a worldwide wireless communication system that could transmit messages, telephone calls, and even facsimile images across the globe. But it was more than that. Tesla dreamed of using the tower to transmit electricity wirelessly to the entire world. Unfortunately, the project was plagued with financial difficulties. Tesla's vision was grand, but the funds required to realize it were beyond his reach. Despite his attempts to secure further funding, the project was eventually abandoned, leaving the giant structure as a silent testament to Tesla's unfulfilled dreams. Tesla's genius also led him down some darker paths. He claimed to have developed a death beam, a weapon that could end wars by making them too destructive to wage. But like many of Tesla's ideas this too remained largely in the realm of speculation. Despite his genius, Tesla's final years were marked by financial struggles and obscurity. Yet it is undeniable that Tesla was a man ahead of his time, a wizard of electricity whose inventions and ideas continue to shape our world. When Nikola Tesla passed away in 1943, he was virtually forgotten by the world he helped shape. A sad reality for a man who had given so much to the world of science and innovation. In the later years of his life, Tesla faced numerous financial difficulties. His generous nature and lack of business acumen left him impoverished. A stark contrast to the wealth he had once known. Tesla spent his final years living in a small New York hotel room, feeding pigeons from his window and working on theoretical inventions. He continued to dream big, but without the financial backing needed to bring his ideas to life. A dreamer until the end he held fast to his vision of a world powered by free energy, a vision that unfortunately, was too radical for his time. His death in January of 1943, was met with little fanfare. The world had moved on, seemingly forgetting the man who had once electrified it with his ideas. His work, revolutionary as it was, largely went unrecognized during his lifetime. His eccentricity and tendency to work in secrecy often led to his inventions being attributed to others. His name was lost in the annals of history, overshadowed by contemporaries like Thomas Edison. But, as time went on, the world began to realize the significance of Tesla's work. His inventions and theories laid the foundation for modern alternating current electricity supply systems, wireless communication, and even remote control technology. The man once deemed a mad scientist was now celebrated as a visionary. In the world of science recognition often comes posthumously and for Tesla this was certainly the case. His name is now synonymous with innovation and futurism. There are statues, museums, and even a unit of measurement named in his honor, not to mention a certain electric car company that bears his name. Today, we remember Nikola Tesla as a visionary inventor who was far ahead of his time. The forgotten inventor is forgotten no more. His legacy endures, reminding us that sometimes the world simply isn't ready for the visionaries who dare to dream beyond its boundaries. While Tesla's life may have ended in obscurity, his legacy lives on in every device that uses electricity. His visionary ideas and inventions are the bedrock of our modern world. Every time we switch on a light, use a smartphone, or drive an electric car, we are living testament to Tesla's genius. He dreamed of a world powered by clean, renewable energy, and today, we're witnessing the realization of that dream. His name resonates in the Tesla Electric Car Company, a firm at the forefront of sustainable transportation. This is a testament to his enduring influence. The realm of radio and wireless technology, a field Tesla pioneered, has transformed the way we communicate and connect. His vision for wireless transmission of energy, though not fully realized, continues to inspire scientists and inventors today. Nikola Tesla, a man of many languages, a visionary inventor, and a true genius, indeed left an indelible mark on our world. If you enjoy the content, please consider subscribing to my channel.